Welcome to Rover's Readers, an at-home phonics learning and reading platform. Visit roversreaders.com to download the following lesson and follow along with us today. Today's lesson can be found in Book 1, pages 8 and 9. Teacher Sadia here again. Thanks for coming to class today. Do you remember what sound this makes? Arr! That's right. It says k, k, like cat. Great. How about this sound? Great job. It says ah, ah, like apple. But today we are going to learn the letter T. Do you know what sound the letter T makes? It says T. Now, What words have the t sound? I know, turtle. T, t, turtle. Mmm, and mouse. Arr! That's right, Rover. Mouse has the mmm sound. What about table. Yeah, table has the t sound. T table. And tomato. Yes, tomato has a t sound. Wow, you are so smart. Now let's read our sentence to see how many t words we can find. A tiny tarantula lives in a tomato. Wow, I hear so many t words here. Okay, let's read it again one more time and we can point out the t sounds together. A t tiny t tarantula lives in a t tomato. Great job. We have three t words. Now remember, when we are practicing new sounds, we must also learn how to write them. With that being said, let's learn to write the letter T. Here we have the uppercase T and the lowercase T. To write the uppercase T, we start at the top and make a straight line to the bottom. Then we go back to the top and make a line across. Great job. To make the lowercase t, we start at the top and make a line straight down to the bottom. Then we go to the middle and make a line across. See? That was easy, but now we need to practice writing the letter T using our pencils. Do you have your pencil ready? Great, now follow along in your workbooks as we trace the upper and lowercase T. Start at the top and make a straight line down to the bottom. Then go back to the top and make a line across. That's a perfect uppercase T. Now let's do the lowercase T. Start at the top and make a straight line down to the bottom. Then go to the middle and make a line across. Let's do it again. Start at the top and make a straight line down to the bottom. Then go back to the top 
and make a line across. Now the lowercase t. Start at the top and make a line to the bottom and go to the middle and make a line across. Now try doing the last few by yourself. You can follow along with the lesson if you need any help. Those upper and lowercase t's look amazing, but we still need a bit more practice. So let's go to the next page where we will practice writing some more lowercase t's. Now remember, start at the top, make a straight line down to the bottom, then go to the middle and make a line across. Go to the top, make a straight line down to the bottom, and go to the middle, make a line across. Those look great. Why don't you try tracing the last few lowercase t's by yourself? And follow along with the video if you need a little extra help. You did such a great job today, and I am so proud of you. I hope to see you next time when we learn about the letter M. Do you know what sound the letter M makes? It says, mm, like monster. All right, have a great day. See you next time. Bye.